Hey guys, what is up? What is up? Welcome guys. We are making progress. I have not been um, doing this YouTube thing for that long. So when I say progress is being met, it is being met and I am excited. So thank you guys so much for joining me. I wanted to definitely switch this up. I actually even got a location today and I think we're going to be in here for a while. So uh, we'll, we'll, we'll try to figure out this situation. Um, but today I kind of wanted to talk to you guys about do your fashion week because yes, it's happening in September around the corner. Um, and it's probably my most favorite season one, because it's fall and I love coats and I love layering and I love like, overly big stuff and I mean I just feel like I could shine in September baby I could shine and it's not too cold like we could do that um and two because it is the you know the biggest release of the Vogue edition um and I mean it's a lot of everyone's in town a lot of people are in town so guys I've been going to New York Fashion Week for years now uh, and I just, over the years, I've learned so many tips and tricks, and I got so many for those who are just entering, and even those who've kind of tiptoed in and just need some, like, okay, Charlie, um, we need, we need some tips, we need some tips, you're trying to get into these shows, you're trying to get the invites, you're trying to get in with the end, because y'all know I'll be in with the end, so here we go. <laughs> So one of the first things you want to do if you want to get into an, a, a New York Fashion Week sh uh, show, and when I say um, New York Fashion Week show, uh, I'm kind of talking about the official one, which is the CFDA, which is under, uh, that's the Council Federation CF of American Designers. <laughs> Oh Lord, that was it. That was it. Oh my God, slow moment. And yeah, I could not see. So I was not about to grab my glasses to figure out what this was. Okay, we're just gonna keep it moving. Next. <laughs> so I'm gonna, and I'm gonna show you my screen because I feel like you guys deserve to kind of see this. Uh, and I'm gonna tell you exactly uh, what uh, I say the first thing to do, which is to go to this website and I'm gonna show you how to um, get some press invites. So Shared screen, here we go. Shared screen, I'm still here y'all. Yeah, I did not realize like at one point I was still there. Anyways, so this is uh, CFDA. This website here is actually, I copied a URL. Let me copy in here so you guys can see it. Uh, oh, right there. Uh, CFDA.com slash, I mean, slash fashion slash calendar. If you go on there, you'll be able to see the official calendar that's already up. Um, it's August. So typically, uh, I think it came out the second week in August. They usually do a big announcement. If you're on LinkedIn, you'll see uh, whoever is the head at the time is going to tell you, you know, everyone, hey, the schedule is out. So this is like the official New York Fashion Week schedule. And guys, there's a lot more, but this is the official. And yeah, who am I playing? I can't see. I'm gonna put my glasses on really quick so I can know what I'm talking about here. And then we gonna take it off because I just, they, they cute. Like anyone that wears glasses just don't wanna wear glasses all the time, you know? So when you get on the website, <clears throat> you guys can kind of see still, kind of see what's going on here. You're gonna click on the official schedule and these are literally the people who are showcasing uh, this season. Um, and as the uh, weeks progress, sometimes you'll see some new add-ons uh, here and there. Uh, they'll keep updating it. You might see some changes, but guys, this is kind of, it, it is what it is. And yeah, we got some big names here. Uh, I see some Washington DC natives. I see, guys, this is a crazy lineup. All right, so what you wanna do is, we'll just go start with the first one is, what I like to do is to figure out who is the PR agency behind the design that's showcasing. So for example, Teddy Von, Von Ranson, I'm not really familiar with this one. Copy, we'll go back to that. I'm gonna open up a new tab here. Uh, paste, I probably got some crazy shit on there. Uh, so that's a designer and I'm gonna put 
publicist, right? So I'm a publicist. So wait, did I spell that right? Y'all, I really can't spell. I'm a publicist. So that's how I know this is what you do because this is what I do. <laughs> so here you'll see uh, Teddy Von, Swin Von Rinson comes up and PR inquiries right here, bad pal. And sometimes this can look different for other designers. Um, sometimes the designer's PR agency is in-house. So it might say press at teddyvonranson.com, you know, or, you know, for this one, it looks like they've outsourced this agency, whoever this agency is. Like, this is how nosy I am. This is why I'm, I'm good at what I do. Uh, rep slash agency. Uh, so you kind of see, oh, who is this agency? Because, you know, y'all, they might be hiring. Who knows? <laughs> um, oh, <laughs> clearly I did that wrong. But anyways, uh, here we go. So it looks like uh, whoever, who I did not put that in right, but we get the point. So <laughs> we'll retract that part. But what you want to do is once you get the agency's information, then you can go ahead and send them a personal email and, and let them know why you want to attend their show. Maybe you're an influencer and you feel like you deserve to be seen on their front row because you get engagement or maybe you're a publicist and you're trying to get them, you know, published into like some hot magazine company that you work for, uh, or maybe you're a fashion stylist and you need you want to establish connections so you know you need to do some polls you know let them know why you want to get in um they might never respond they might respond uh but it's a game you just that's how that's how we get in baby you just got to keep trying and if you have a business email even better it just looks more professional so that's the first way to get in right now the second thing you want to do is uh you can try i don't know if you guys heard of launch metrics uh, which is GPS radar. This is uh, like the version of it that you can download on your phone. They don't have a web browser version, um, at least not that I'm not familiar with. I've always used the app. Um, and what I'll do is on my next video, I kind of show you guys quickly how I do it, but I'll just kind of walk you through the process. And what it does is you'll be able to, um, can I? I'm gonna take myself off of here. Stop share, because we could talk for a second now. Um, stop share. Okay, I think we're yeah. So uh, here we go. Ah. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm like hilarious to myself, but um. Yeah, so when you go on the Fashion GPS, this is such a cool app because uh, you can register as an influencer, as a blogger, as a fashion stylist, as a PR firm, as um, an agency. Uh, and what you do, you go on there, you get your credentials, you tell them why you want to get on there. And they track a lot of the big shows that you saw on that list earlier when I opened up the CFDA calendar. Um, a lot of the publicists from those shows go on there, let people know that the show is going on. Uh, it's happening. You can send a request directly through the app and say, hey, I want to get in. And if they let you in, they'll email you and say, hey, you're in. Or they may not email you at all. It means you're not in. <laughs> but I mean, it's like I said, it's a gamble. The first time I tried it, guys, I got into mostly everything that I wanted to get in that I could get into. A lot of it is timing. A lot of it is patience. If you don't get in this season, try next season, but you have to keep trying. Uh, and last but not least, least, if nothing works, just do what I used to do. Just sneak in. I spent the first, <laughs> I mean, let's be real. And I feel like anybody that's been to Fashion Week does that. Like I, the first time I went to a fashion show, I got invited one time. I saw how easy it was to like go to things and I just started sneaking in guys. And it was just, it was like game over after that. Once they start seeing how cool you are and they see your one show, they like, oh, you or she got to be important. Now I'm not inviting, advising anyone to do nothing illegal because that is wrong. <laughs> but if you don't get caught. <laughs> so someone might be asking, well, Sky, how did you sneak in? Right. Well, this is how we snuck in. 
I just look important, literally. People really just treat you good when you look important. It's just ridiculous, guys, but it works. I walked up in there. They thought I was Lupita something. I, I had a haircut back then, all this other crazy stuff. I was like, yeah. And, and yeah, walked right in. Hey, y'all. Hey, girl. Hey, friends. <laughs> you know, and if you feel like if your energy is given this person, then don't do it. Don't embarrass yourself at your fashion week. It's for the bold. It's for the people that like adventure, people like me. <laughs> Guys, thanks for tuning in. And I'll definitely put in, uh, putting up more tips on uh, fashion events and whatnot. And it's a pleasure. Have a good one.